Welcome to the Wandering Bard. I am Jeremy Grafe, and I am joined by the lovely house elf one behind the production desk. She's waving, even if you can't see her. And yes, Judith, it has been busy. I'm sorry I didn't get back to you. It is most unfortunate that the east coast of Australia is experiencing snow. So that's not something I imagine on a regular basis. So that can't be fun. But I will respond soon. So, I have uh, a good bit of music tonight. And without really trying, I seem to have made a little bit of a Celtic celebration tonight. So, a few of my favorite Irish bits. Yeah. Ugh. Yeah, it was high 80s here today. High humidity should also be the thing that you infer is also true. I normally don't mind, but... Ah. Ah, well, that's good that you're not dealing with snow personally. Of all the precipitation, that is the second least fun. Hail being the least fun. Anyway. And come tell me, Sean O'Farrell, tell me why you hurry so. Hush a buckle, hush and listen, and his cheeks were all aglow. I bear orders from the captain, get you ready quick and soon. For the pikes must be together at the rising of Pikes must be together at the rising of And come tell me, Sean O'Farrell, where the gathering is to be At the old spot by the river, quite well known to you and me On the whole of the signal token, this allowed the marching to With your pike upon your shoulder Freedom. 
kingdom tis the rising1798 rebel songs. I don't think they were written in 1798. They're meant to commemorate 1798, just for those who want to be sure. It's a wee bit warm. <laughs> no, no compressors. Acoustic guitars just don't sound as good when they're plugged in. So I'm working on one of the things that I would like to do um, with the with the subscription money that's flowing in is buy a new mic stand so I can just mic my acoustics. And that would mean that it would be a lot nicer to play things like my 12 string <laughs> and maybe my Citern. And all of those plug in, but I think something really gets lost when we plug in acoustic guitars. I mean, they sound okay, but I think it usually takes a little bit of EQing before they sound as nice as what I think they should. And of course, nothing beats real acoustics. But hey, we're doing the best we can with what we've got. And uh, I'm really stoked that I get to hang out with some friends from Australia and Massachusetts and Canada tonight. And I'm assuming that Misha is ensconced uh, somewhere fun in West Virginia, hopefully that nice brewery. <clears throat> but um, yeah, anyway... I, I don't know what to tell you about that, David. Um, I can't really do much about it now. Hopefully that ceases. We haven't changed anything in terms of our software. So I don't know. There's, there's not a setting here that's changed since last week. 
So I'm going to press on and hopefully that won't be something that is plaguing everyone and hopefully will not be on the replay. So um, sorry for that, folks. Broad as I was walking one evening in the spring I heard a maiden bad them so sweetly for to sing her chain she rattled in her hand and thus replied she I love my love because I know my love loves me. Cruel were his parents who sent my love to see. And cruel was the galleon that bore my love from me. Since there is although they ruin me I love my love because I know my love loves me strong I weave a garland I weave it very fine Roses, daisies, lilies, I'll mix the eglantine, and I'll present it to my love when he returns from sea. I love my love because I know my love loves me. As she there sat weeping, her love he came on land. And hearing she was in Bethlehem, he ran straight out of hands. He flew into her loving arms, and thus replied he, I love my love because I know my love loves me. So now these two are married and happy may they be. Turtle doves together in love and unity. All pretty maids with patience wait that have your loves at sea. I love my love because I know my love loves me. For I love my love because I know my love. Loves me. Well, hey, um, I'm not really sure what's going on with settings. It's really hard to troubleshoot it. Um, so I know I'm going to fix it for the VOD that I put on YouTube. So if there's a problem, it might be on Twitch's end. In any case, we're pressing on. Um, and for those of you who are on the East Coast of the United States, that is, um, in a couple of weeks, I am going to be guesting in West Virginia with the Mighty Volgamut. That will be the weekend of June 25th and 26th. So I'm really excited to get a chance to play with Dan and Chris again, and hopefully Misha if he gets back in time. Um, 
and Kathleen Finnegan and so many friends that are at West Virginia Festival. I'm really excited to see them. And um, the house elf is coming on the road, so you might get to see her if you come out. But um, link should be in the chat to get those tickets if you are anywhere near West Virginia in the next few weeks. And on a related note, on Thursday, June the 23rd, there's going to be a very special Volgamut Live that will be broadcast live and direct from Artifice Ales in Mead here in Mannheim, Pennsylvania. So if you are anywhere near the Pennsylvania Renaissance Fair um, in Mannheim, I would check that out. That should be a really fun night. I know for sure that Michael and I are going to be playing. I'm not sure if anybody else is confirmed. We might have some special surprise guests. But in any case, it'll be nice to play with Misha again. And it'll be nice to do so, well, essentially in my backyard at one of my favorite craft breweries. So, anyway. Yeah. Thank you, David. Speaking of good drinking songs... Here, wait, I have a better idea. Let's try this. Ah, yes. You're right, Lindsay, that is Celtic Fling Weekend. But, you know, if I have a choice between hanging out and performing with friends, I'm nearly always going to pick performing with friends. So, if you can't make West Virginia, but you're in Pennsylvania, by all means, there's going to be some great stuff there. But I'm going to West Virginia to hang out with Volgamut. Let's try this again. <laughs> Them was Lately come forth for the low country with never a penny of money. Here, the fellow will drink to be. Pardon them was ever To all good fellows wherever they be with never a penny of money. Come forth of the low country with never a penny of money. Lately 
come forth of the low country with never a penny Hydrated friends. It is warm. I'm glad you turned the airco on. I am glad I turned the airco on. I think that was a good move. <laughs> I can only imagine what this would be like otherwise. It's like our own personal sauna. <laughs> well, hey, so, um, not really Celtic, but in the spirit of um, a country seeking to defend its sovereignty against invaders, this is for the people of Ukraine.
Now, back to our regularly scheduled Celtic programming. <laughs> ah. Well, I hope everybody is managing to stay hydrated and cool where they are. Whew. You know, I really wish there was such a thing as an actual, true... Fremen reclamation suit. I'd be into that. Oh, the summer time is coming And the trees are sweetly blooming And the wild mountain time grows around
together to a wild mountain time all around the blooming heather will you come and see me and we'll all go together to pull wild mountain time all around the blooming heather will you go I see I see that my brother has shown up in real time tonight. That's great. Hey, Nathan. Hope you and Joanna and Ben are doing well. Oh, yeah. Well, hey, Mom and Dad. <clears throat> Mom and Dad don't show up in the chat. They just do the direct line thing. Well, friends, I've got good news and I've got bad news. Bad news first. I only have one more song. But the good news is, I have one more song. And and maybe better news? What is it? Well, it's uh, by your Twitcher a towel. <sighs> no, just kidding. Um, <clears throat> anyway, I mean... I don't know. I don't know any good bands called Wooden Men, but I know one pretty damn great band called Iron Maiden, Misha. You'd probably like them too. Fun harmonies. Anyway, I'm pretty sure most of you that I've seen in the chat know this one. So, uh, 
Imagine, take yourself to the spot. You're in your favorite grove in your local Renaissance fair. It's the end of the pub sing. You're next to some of your dearest friends. You're enjoying one of your very favorite beverages. It has been the very model of an excellent day. One might say it is the very platonic essence of a good day. It is as if you started your day with a shot of Felix Felicitas. Kind friends and companions, and join me in rhyme. Come lift up your voices in chorus with mine. Let us drink and be merry, your grief to refrain. For we may and my never, I'll meet here again. Here's a health to the company and one to my lips. Let us drink and be merry, all out of one glass. Let us drink and be merry, all grief to refrain. For we may and my never all meet here again. Here's a health Challenged by a November gale, ere fortune shall prove to be friend or be foe, you will always be with me wherever I go. Here's a health to the company and one to my less. Let us drink. Can be merry, oh, love of one us. Let us drink and be merry, oh, grief to refrain. For we may and might never all meet here again. Well, hey, friends. Thanks so much for tuning in tonight. Um, I haven't mentioned, but 
please do give us a subscription here on Twitch. If you've got an Amazon Prime account, you get a free subscription every month, and I would be honored to have yours. Um, also, uh, if you haven't already, please do give a check to the old jeremygrafemusic.com website, which is another great place to subscribe. If you subscribe there, I can get you all kinds of exclusive video and music. And we are honestly very soon to some pretty cool releases. Um, so please give that a shout, uh, a check out. And um, yeah, friends, I will probably see some of you sooner rather than later. But until next time, right here in the Wandering Bard at 8 p.m., good night. Love you all. <laughs>